Madam President, you have been a powerful symbol of unity to all Singaporeans. This is not just because of what the Office of the President represents, but particularly because of how you perform your duties and led us as our President. Throughout your tenure, you showed the way with grounded leadership and a warm heart for the people. Your ability to empathize and resonate with Singaporeans from all walks of life has brought our nation closer together and reminded us that we all have a role to play to make Singapore a better home. As a woman from a minority community, coming from very humble family background, you pursued your education, graduated with a law degree, served in the labor movement and in politics, and eventually occupied the highest office in the land. You showed that our meritocratic system works, that every Singaporean can achieve his or her aspirations, regardless of race, language, or religion, and regardless of family background or station in life. Madam President, as your term of office draws to a close, you can look back on a distinguished and remarkable career in public service and as our president. I still remember what you said when you were first elected six years ago. I am president for everyone. Through your leadership and heart for the people, you have certainly fulfilled your promise. Your efforts to expand opportunities for all have made for a more united and inclusive Singapore where all of us belong and everyone has a part to play. Your commitment to improving our society and your concern for every Singaporean will continue to inspire and guide us all as we refresh our social compact and press forward together. On behalf of the government and the people of Singapore, I thank you for your service to our nation. We bid you and Mr. Mohammed farewell and wish you all the best in all your future endeavors. Thank you very much. <laughs>